Hey everybody, this is Dan from Dan and Breeze Adventures. If you're looking for a really nice outdoor privacy shelter, watch this video. I have a good solution for you. Sorry about that. Uh, if you're new to the channel, Bree and I have a small Intech Fire Pursuit camper, and a privacy shelter always comes in handy when you're out camping. Uh, please enjoy this video. If you have any questions uh, about the shelter that I'm showing you, please uh, ask in the comments below. Uh, and enjoy. Thank you. So the Heliopolis has a four foot by four foot floor. It's a polythyme floor, which is mildew resistant. And also the entire height of the shelter is seven foot. The entire privacy shelter weighs 12 pounds, six ounces. If you have the Helio shower, you'll see that there's a couple of hooks that have been put in place to actually hold the shower head. Also a pocket up here for your towel and another little tiny one, I guess, if you want to put your shampoo or conditioner in there. And inside here, you actually have a pouch for your toilet paper. So it hangs in there. And then the bag just comes down to keep it dry. And you can cinch it if you're taking a shower. And you've also have another little pocket over here in case you want to put uh, your soap or a sponge or anything like that. And you'll see across the bottom, it has mesh to help keep the floor dry and helps with ventilation. So I bought this privacy shelter here at town at REI, and the cost was $149.95. This is the Nemo Helio LX pressure shower. I bought this from REI also, and this was $149.95, and it weighs two pounds and five ounces when it's empty, and it's nine and a half inches by 21 and a half inches. It has a polyurethane coated polyester. It's pressurized by the integrated foot pump. And it'll hold pressure for about seven to 10 minutes. And then it has a silicone sleeve, which you'll see here, that actually holds the shower nozzle in the open position. And it's uh, 22 liters or 5.8 gallons, and the hose is seven feet. You can just hang it up and shower away. If the bag is empty, you can actually put it inside this little bag right here. It goes all inside there and you just Draw it up nice and tight. It's easily packable. So this is the Clean Ways to Go Anywhere portable toilet seat. It's 19 inches by 14 inches by 5 inches deep. And the entire thing weighs 7 pounds without the bag. Uh, it has a standard seat height. So the height here is standard what you see in your toilet at home. And this can actually support up to 500 pounds. It's a high impact thermoplastic construction. All right, so this is the box that this comes in. Uh, these are the bags for the toilet. And they're also made by Go Anywhere. It's the Go Anywhere toilet kit. And inside, every little bag you use has its own bag. And when you open this up, inside, you'll find a heavy duty Ziploc bag. So once this bag, you're done with it, you put it back in this and reseal it. It gives you added protection. And then this is the bag that you actually put in the toilet, which I'll show you in a minute, but it's got all the different powders and chemicals at the bottom that actually help make the liquids into solids. And then each one actually comes with a little wet wipe in case you have the need for one and a little bit of toilet paper, which is kind of cool. So it's pretty neat, works well. So it's real simple to put the bag in. I put the, the big Ziploc in first, just so I don't lose it. And then this whole thing lifts up and there's a net under there that helps support the weight.
There you go. Is that simple? When you're not using it, you can put the lid on. It keeps all the flies out. The Clean Waste Go Anywhere Portable Toilet Seat was $79.95 and I bought it at REI. Thank you for watching so far. Uh, the rest of the video is about the privacy shelter that we used to have that we actually filmed out on um, location. It was the Bash Pro Eclip. Uh, it was about $80. We bought it from Bass Pro. Worked very well for us. Um, and then uh, I didn't stake it down well enough one day. The wind took it down up over a hill. It sustained a little bit of damage, and that's the reason we got the new one. Thank you. So here's the shitter I'm always referring to. It's actually a pretty nice little shelter. You can have the, the rain tarp on, or if not, it's got that mesh. But sometimes it gets so dusty here, I like to keep that out. It's got this zipper you can access from the inside. And you got a strap here for your towels. So I could actually, if I had this close enough to the camper, I could actually, um, you know, use my road shower and run the hose in through the back. So inside, that's it. You got like a little lantern up there. It's got pockets for toilet paper. There's the uh, baby wipes. And here's the, the double duty toilet waste bags. So it's got some sort of power powder inside. Um, gel, it's a bio gel. And then everything kind of folds into a heavier duty bag so that it doesn't leak when you're trying to hike it out of the woods.